gonna zoom you guys in a little bit because I am gonna start with my brows. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows off screen, so I will be right back. Yeah, sorry, I had to fix my hair because I don't know what was going on right now. So we're just gonna go ahead. I just finished up my eyebrows and did some concealer on it. So now, if I'm going to conceal my eyes so I can start doing eyeshadow because I am literally winging this. So I'm gonna make some of my regular concealer that I use for my under eyes, like my regular like skin tone shade. I'm using a little bit of that. I'm about to zoom you guys in in a second. I'm just showing you guys this general. Now I'm going with this yellow shade. And it's the same thing. It's the LA Girl Concealer. And then I'm just going to go ahead and go on my finger. And tap that into my eyelid. And then I don't need to use that much. Try not to like if you have a light hand if you guys notice I didn't really put that much on my eyelid. Um, cause we still have to use more later. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna take a tiny, tiny blender brush. I have a tinier one than this, but I don't feel like grabbing it right now and opening it. Um, so take your bronzer, like whatever bronzer you use. Um, I use the Anastasia uh, powder bronzer and saddle. So I'm gonna take a little bit of that on the tip. I'm just gonna literally outline ever so lightly. I'm going to ever so lightly, like literally outline my natural socket. So now that you have that, you're gonna go back in with the yellow concealer or the regular concealer whichever you have like whichever is i guess better for priming for you i'm just going to go in with the concealer brush that i have so now that you have that you're going to go ahead and get a very very pigmented and pastel purple color Okay. This light purple color right here, that's the one I want to use. But I'm not gonna I'm not fully sure if it's gonna work like fully on its own, so we'll see. But let's go ahead and try it. So you want when you lay it down, you want to use a dense brush because you do want a lot of product. So now, it's finally time for some eyeliner. Now, I'm going to use eyeliner a few times on like this tutorial besides this part here. So don't put the eyeliner away. Milan, I'm just using the Milani, if you can focus, focus, focus. Right, the Milani Stay Matte Eyeliner. So I'm gonna be doing a pretty dramatic liner right now. Or not, I don't know. Whatever I, I'm gonna do whatever I feel comfortable with. And I'm not gonna be pressured by the camera. Sorry y'all, I got pressured by the camera. But now I'm gonna go ahead and start on my skin. I'm going to start off by prepping with my Tarte Poreless Primer. And that's around this little area of my nose, under my eyes, and around my lash lines. I'm going to go ahead and take my Born This Way foundation. 
running low but this is in the color warm beige i know it looks really really dirty but it's actually clean it's just really badly stained and i do have another one it's just somewhere in a box i'm currently in the process of moving so don't know which box that is and i'm just gonna probably just wait till we move in a few oh in a couple of weeks actually We are now going to powder and I'm using this flower powder but I'm like seriously running low and I need to get um, more powder. However, I think I'm going to try the airspun one to see what all the hype is about and see if it's really that good and everything. I'm to get ready for and I have no powder. Lashes. Uh huh, uh huh. These are still kind of drying a bit. I'm going to take the same eyeliner that I use for my eyeliner. Now I'm going to go ahead and go back in with my purple. I'm going to do a little bit more of my inner corner so now that we have that I'm gonna go ahead and oh look how cute that looks I'm gonna go ahead and do a blush I really like the mirror in this little blush and I'm just using the Tarte double duty beauty make every moment count blush palette taking a little blush brush and I'm going to be taking the color. Should I use them all? Now I'm gonna go for that bright color, the, the light pink. I'm just gonna start lightly dusting all over my cheeks, cheekbones really, because I wanna stay high on my cheekbones because I'm gonna take it across. Do highlights. So for my highlights, I'm going to be going in first with my Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Gleam Kit, and I'm going to be taking Mimosa. I'm going to be taking Mimosa and Starburst. So yeah, I'm going to be taking Mimosa and Starburst. A little bit of hard candy. So I'm mixing all those together and I'm putting hard candy glass because that's the one that has a little purple like sheen to it. And I like it and I'm gonna apply this without a mirror because we're badass like that. Uh, dotty dots with eyeliner on my face.
so yeah just some lipstick now and I'm just applying my NYX liner and load there we go and that was a NYX liner and load in the color never listen I love this lipstick it's my fave um so yeah so we're about done with this look um it's super cute so thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you're commenting, liking, and subscribing if you want more. Also, make sure you stay tuned for my monthly horoscope reading, which you guys have been recommending for again and again and again. Make sure you're buying our merch. Check out our website if you need hoops, lip liner, and all things travel. Make sure you check out my website for my merch. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really genuinely appreciate it. Bye. Mwah.